I'm Meryl Rose. According to a recent report in the New York Times, nursing homes are overdiagnosing patients with schizophrenia in order to conceal high rates at which they're prescribing antipsychotic medications. Attorney Jim Higgins with the Higgins Firm is here now to tell us more about that. This is disturbing, isn't it? Yes, it, it really is. This is uh, the government began keeping statistics on um, antipsychotic medication in nursing homes a few years ago and these studies are just now coming out and, and it's unsettling. What we found is that they diagnosed about 21 percent of the residents with schizophrenia or something that needs an antipsychotic medication whereas in the general population it's less than one percent. We know that those are there are not that many people in nursing homes with that diagnosis. It's simply that they're using this medication to, to chemically restrain people. Mm. You know, it's easier, it's cheaper to take care of somebody that's medicated. You don't have to answer call lights. You don't have to get them out of bed if they're out of medication. So it, it's really a disturbing statistic. That's really difficult. Has your office seen a pattern of this? Oh yeah, we, we saw it way before this came out. It's kind of just proving what we already knew. Good nursing homes don't do it bad nursing homes that want to increase their profit it is they they it is much cheaper to over medicate somebody hire less staff make more money it and it's dangerous when should someone call your firm well at any time if they feel that they've got a loved one that's been over medicated if they got somebody who's had a fall or 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 has bed sores malnourished and, and a lot of times that's because of being over medicated call us immediately. If you don't need us, we'll send you in the right direction, but you don't pay anything unless we win your case. All right, Jim Higgins, thank you so much for being with us today. If you'd like more information, you can visit thehigginsfirm.com or call the number you see on the screen.